Hello there assassins, this is Wheel and welcome back to another Wheel Assassin Guide. This is actually a appreciation video to all of you who joined my 50th stream episode. Thank you so much for that incredible series. Um, it is of course not done, things will be a little bit slower from now on. Um, I will explain all in a news video coming soon as well. Um, but um, I just want to say a huge thank you to everyone who was in that stream and to all of you who decided to take part in the competition. Uh, the competition was to build something related to the Wheel Assassin name. So it could have been something to do with the channel, something to do with the game I play, or even just something random to do with the Assassinhood. Um, and you guys came up with some crazy ideas. I'm going to do it like a showcase video as well um, to show you all of those. So I'll put a card in the top right hand of the screen. You can like beam over there and check out some of those insane creations if you weren't already in the stream with us. Um, so this street, this tutorial here is not just for people who are in the stream. This is for everybody who is subscribed to the channel. You all mean a lot to me, and um, I, I, I think I say it too much, but like I do, I do mean it every single time. And I am very, very grateful and thankful for all of you being here. Um, and it's so hard to not be able to like say thank you in person. You know, like you can't really express your thanks without like shaking someone's hand or hugging someone or like you know just doing something for that person. Um, so with YouTube, it's a little bit hard. So um, I've got to use what I have, and I, what I have now is Minecraft. So I built this awesome looking trophy just here. And at the bottom of the stand here, you have every single name of the subscribers who are in that stream and who participated in the competition. Now I know that <laughs> I know we're trying to make the competition like an actual, you know, competitive thing. But I just don't have the heart to like pick one winner. I'm just not that type of guy. So um, we have all of the names down here of everyone who was in the stream and everyone who participated in the competition. Now during the tutorial, I'm not going to teach you guys how to add everyone's names because at the end of the day, you might not want like a random person's name on your build. Um, but what I will do is show you how to add something, um, a message from me to your build. So you're going to have to write it yourselves, of course, because unfortunately I can't get in your worlds. Um, but uh, it will be, you know, a very personalised message for, for all of you to um, say thank you uh, to you all for uh, just being here and supporting the channel and supporting me as a content creator uh, and in real life, so thank you. Uh, so over in the middle we have For the Assassin Hood, and you sometimes need reminding that you're a true hero to me, and that is true. That is 100% true. So um, that is on my trophy just here, but I'm going to kind of make a message for you guys too. Let's grab ourselves the two materials that we will need. Well, three technically if you count the signs. Um, but uh, yeah, let's get started with today's tutorial. So to begin, you will need to take yourself some blocks of diamond, some blocks of gold, and finally some birch signs. Now then, we're going to go ahead and take our diamonds for the base. Now because we're using um, the most valuable material just here out of the two here, uh, for the base, you're probably thinking, like, why don't you make the trophy out of diamond instead? Well, it's because you guys mean a lot more than a trophy to me, so let's go ahead and build ourselves in here. I know that was cheesy, but I do mean it. <laughs> let's go ahead and build one, two, three, four, five blocks, just like so. Go ahead and build diagonally away from that for another five just here. And we're going to build it into a square shape, so diagonally from each other, like so. Now on the corners, you can connect just the one block, like this. And then we build all of this shape up to two layers, so just outline the entire diamond shape down here to two layers in height like so you can leave the center hollow if you want to because at the end of the day if you wanted to like knock out a gap in the top of the trophy uh, the base is slightly big enough apart from that one block there uh, to build like a, almost like a house inside of it maybe so um, if you're up for that then go ahead and do so that'd be cool so take your blocks of gold place three in the gaps just here around the corners just like so then you'll build three up from these ones, like that, and then one in the center of these threes, looking like a crown, pretty cool. Then we'll go ahead and connect up the four sort of ones here, just by adding three throughout the center, one here and one here. So you almost have like a plus sign on the top. What we need to do next is build up one, two, three, and four, and the center here, we build up for two. Here on the corners, you add in one, two, three and four just like so so we're building like a pyramid shape there it's just we don't like end the pyramid off with like one here and one here that would be way too big so we just go for that shape there it almost looks like a goblet a little bit more than a trophy um but uh it kind of looks cool at the same time 
All right. Any horror Harry Potter fans? Any horror? <laughs> what was I trying to say? Any Harry Potter fans? Let me know in the comments down below. I really want to make some more Harry Potter tutorials. All right, let's go up here. Building one. Out for two. And we're going to do out for two on all sides. So you build another plus sign, just bigger on the top. Like so. Looks like a helicopter. Then we build one, two, three, and four, just like so. So you have this cool shape here. On the front side, we're going to build up for three so one is connected below in the middle another are three just here two rows of five so we go out again on both sides and then you complete it with three at the top we copy this to the back as well so we'll go for three just here three again five here and five again on this layer then three in the center like so looking cool you can see what it's going to connect up now on the corners Build your threes, sorry, your twos to connect to you each other with two lots of three. Then we'll do the same on the opposite side. Building this nice and 3D, which is pretty cool. There we go. And then we build ourselves two down here, two down here, and two in here. So, two down here, two here, and two here. So basically another two lots of three. Cool. Then you can add three on the top, and three on the top this side. So we literally just made the same shape. <laughs> <laughs> that looks so much more confusing than the original one than it actually is. Ah, well, never mind. It's always good to look confusing because it means it looks difficult and like people will be more shocked. So whew, keep that a secret. All right, let's go to here and build two, just here, and two this side as well. Then we'll build out the two just by one and one on the opposite side, nice and symmetrical, and then build up for three. One, two, three. One, two, three, and that will match up with the top of the trophy. Then we build in for one so it connects to the actual trophy. And then we do two across the top. Like so. On both sides, that is. There you have it. Drop back in and place one here, one here, one here, and one here. And then build another plus sign. Well, sorry. Another four just here. And then you can stack up two from the bottom. Like so. To make it look like it's a bit hollow on the inside. Like an actual trophy would be. Awesome. Okay, it's now for the sign. So now then, all you must do for your signs is take in your birch. You're going to write yourself a top sign that says built for and then you actually put your name in here. You don't write insert name here. Trust me, I've probably done that in the past before. Um, so you put built for and then your name, your gamer tag or whatever you want to call yourself. And then on the bottom one down here, you write yourself, you are an assassin, a hero and a legend. And it should say and a legend. I completely forgot the A. <laughs> I don't know how to spell apparently. Uh, and then put don't forget that. So it's a bit of a motivational message, and um, I truly do mean it, guys. Do not forget that you are a legend. Um, it's very, very important in today's society to um, appreciate everything that you are and not try and be someone that you're not. So um, please don't forget who you are and um, just keep being the amazing person that you are and supporting uh, the channel and just being crazy awesome. So thank you so much, guys. Awesome. Well, that is the end of this very, very quick tutorial. But like I said, thank you to everyone who was in the 50th stream special. Thank you so, so much. Please be on the lookout for the news video coming very, very shortly. That will be telling you all the little details for what is happening with streaming and um, what is to come and stuff like that. So please be on the lookout for all of that stuff coming soon. There's going to be a few specials on the way too. So that's going to be very, very helpful to look out for too. Um, and uh, yeah, just like I said, do not forget your identity. Do not forget who you are as a person. Uh, don't try and be someone that you're not because at the end of the day you are already a legend you don't need to play up and try and be the rock for example you know not that the rock has ever done that because he's a legend but <laughs> you know what i'm saying just try and be as much yourself as you possibly can because you're amazing take care of yourselves have an excellent rest of your day stay safe and um goodbye for now assassins thank you so much